guys, this is Jared with DCR, demonstrating how to set up Google Cloud Printing. Very cool cloud printing option that we would like our customers to try and use. It's uh, free to use. You just have to install the Google Chrome browser, which is very simple, and uh, create a Google account. You can, you know, if you've got five people you want to use this um, service all you have to do is create that one account and I'll show you how you can just share that one account and with the printer and all that good stuff um, so to get started all you have to do first we're going to install the Google Chrome OS you can go through Internet Explorer you can go to Firefox Safari any of your popular browsers you can go to um, and once you just go to and you've probably seen it once you go to www.google.com up here um, over here you'll see the install Google Chrome um, most time you'll see it if you do not all you have to do is after the dot com um, backslash is just type Chrome and it will take you to the page so here we're gonna download Google Chrome um, you can either set it as your uh, default browser or you can uncheck it if you don't I, I personally love Google Chrome so I'm gonna accept and install doesn't take like I said it doesn't take long at all to install um, and it's just gonna run through a minute here okay so now uh, Google Chrome's installing running this little installer um, pretty quick okay once it's done you know it asks you to, for some preference stuff um, I'm gonna choose Google of course and here we are it's going to uh, open uh, Google Chrome for us so now we're using Google Chrome you got a little another tab up here that kinda welcomes you um, if we go back to the desktop now we've got our Google Chrome icon um, so I'm just gonna simply go into the um, Google Chrome and I'm gonna set it as my default browser um, so now if we go back to www.google.com and the first thing we're gonna want to do you have to create an account we're gonna create a Gmail account um, and we're gonna go here and you are just simply gonna run through here and fill in this stuff uh, I'm going to pause this video, go ahead and create an account, and I'll get back with you guys in just a second. Now we have created our Gmail account. The next thing we are going to do is there is some setup within Chrome for the cloud printing, and I'm going to show you guys how to set that up. What you're going to do is, um, when you're on Google, um, using Chrome, you're going to go to this little wrench here, click on the wrench, and go to Options. When you go to options on the left hand side here you're going to see this option for under the hood you're going to click that and we're going to scroll down to the Google Cloud Print section and we're going to sign into Google Cloud Print since we are already signed I'm already signed into my Gmail account I'm just going to say finish printer registration sometimes it might ask you to log in you're just going to use your uh, whatever Gmail account that you signed up for okay um, what you want to do is you're going to go into this manage printers part section and this is the this is where you're going to set up your Google cloud printing options I don't I'm not going to have any printer set up on uh, remote machine end I'm going to do all my setup here I'm sitting here in our office here in DCR and I'm going to want to print my documents here to the printers that I have set up here from where I'm, I'm using log me in um, when I use log me in I want to be able to print the document from you know whatever remote uh, software you're using so I'm gonna set up my printers here I'm gonna show you how to do that right now so what you're gonna do is you may have Google Cloud ready printers um, they're they're coming out newer when HP has some models but more and more they're coming out with them most people are not so what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna go to this add a classic printer this is just the page that goes through exactly what I've just explained to you when we went you know to the wrench and options under the hoods and logged in so I'm just gonna back out of that. I just want to show you guys that
So what I'm going to do is I'm going to click on printers. And these, this is the list of printers that I'm going to have um, on my network, whether I'm in the office or at home. So you should see all of the printers that you have set up on the computer that you're using in your home or network or whatever. The one that I'm going to want to share is this Lexmark E250DN. That's just the printer that I have. What's really cool with the Google Cloud printing is, um, and I've just created this account. My, my name is not Bronsteed. I just made up a name. Um, so don't try to contact me through uh, email because I'm going to delete this account as soon as I'm done with this video. But you can go through and you can actually share the printer with, um, you know, people who have other Gmail accounts. So if, you know, there's... Um, we do a lot of restaurants um, and grocery stores, so if we have you know a generic account, we want five different people to use it, um, and we we have maybe say three people with different Gmail accounts. We can add them all here under this printer, and they'll be able to use this service and print to this printer. Really cool stuff. Um, so that's how you do it. You just click on the share. Um, you're gonna go here, and you're just gonna add in the different uh, Gmail accounts here. Pretty simple. So what I'm going to do is um, on the remote end, I'm going to now go into the remote end, and I'm actually in log me in, and I'm actually on my home PC here, and I have Google Chrome loaded already, all that good stuff. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to check it out, make sure I'm going to go to my wrench, go to options. Let me blow this up for you guys. Go to under the hood, go to the Google Cloud printing section. Here we go. So I'm already signed in, of course, so I'm going to manage print settings here. Just go back up, and you're going to see the same thing. So now, through the cloud, since I'm actually seeing this printer that's actually hooked up to my laptop that I'm in the office in right now, I'm seeing it from my home computer because I shared it. This is what Google Cloud Printing does. So I've got this printer here. So what I can do is, if I'm just browsing around, or I'm actually just going to minimize and go to my desktop. And I'm just going to open, simple, I've got this test document here. So let's say I'm running a report, uh, whether it's PosiTouch, SMS, anything really. Uh, you can you know save the file, whatever that you want. Just save it, save it to the desktops. If you've got a folder that you want to save it to, you know, go ahead and do that. And within this, I'm going to click on print and upload file to print. If you have some options, you can go back into manage printers, but I'm going to select a file from my computer. And I'm going to look on my desktop. And I'm going to grab my test document. And now, once you grab your document, or you select your document, then you can select the printer you want to print it to. So here in the office, my Lexmark E250DN, I'm going to select it, and I'm going to hit print. You can say creating a print job, print job add, and what's going to do is it's pulling that file up. It's going to take it a minute, you know, it's going to do what it needs to do, and then it's going to shoot it down to my printer here at the office. And that is how Google Cloud Printing works in a nutshell. This is the, the setup. It's not hard to use at all. You know, feel free to, to test it out, but this is what uh, we're going to be using here at DCR. So, hope this video has been informative. If you have any questions, you can uh, email us or give us a call here at the office. All right, thank you and have a great week.